Hello, Cancer. And welcome to Blunt Sagittaro. My name is Robin. And Cancer, today we're going to talk about the person on your mind. We're going to see what they're thinking and feeling about you. We're going to find out what you can expect from them. So let's talk about this person. Let's see what's going on inside their brain. So spirit guides, talk to us about the person on Cancer's mind. Children. So your love life is being affected by children. So Cancer, you could have children. They could have children. But somewhere there are children in the mix <laughs> that are an obstacle. And, um... You know, sometimes it can be challenging to date when you're a parent. It's not always the easiest thing. So let's see what's going on here. Let's see what kind of obstacles are being presented. What do you want to say to Cancer about this, please? And Cancer, for those of you who are interested, I am doing personal readings. So if you want one of those, the link is in the description box. Holy shit, that flew over there. It's in the description box over, or below. So we have the Ace of Pentacles in reverse. Hold on. So we have the Two of Pentacles in reverse. So... We have the Six of Swords, and we have the Queen of Swords. So um, they're seeing you as the Queen of Swords in reverse, Cancer. So they feel like you don't want to put up with any kind of BS from them. What did this person do? Ooh, the King of Pentacles in reverse, the Ten of Wands in reverse, the Six of Wands in reverse, the Ace of Swords in reverse. And on the bottom of the deck, we have the Knight of Swords in reverse, and he's with the Queen of Cups in reverse. There you are. There's a lot of... Um, People who are not happy. The masculine is definitely not happy. But neither is the feminine. So the masculine's coming up as the sun in reverse and the king of pentacles in reverse. The feminine's coming up as the queen of swords in reverse, the queen of cups in reverse. But the overall vibe is the knight of swords. That's cutting this out. So let's see what they want to cut out here. What is what is this ace of pentacles? What is this? Um, what didn't? What, what the hell happened here? What is going on? So the ace. So they see you as the empress. They see you as one pissed off empress and the chariot and the three of swords. So they see you as one pissed off empress. <laughs> they, there you are <laughs> coming up as the empress, but they feel hurt. Um, or do they feel your hurt? The hanged man in reverse, ace of swords. Not sure. They're confused. Your person is very confused about what has happened. Um, they want to move forward. They see you as the empress. So someone is abundant, sexy, beautiful understanding, compassionate, um, but makes things happen in their life. They don't just sit back. They take action. She is the mother, you know, she's the virgin mother. Um, they see you as very caring, but very pissed with them. <laughs> um, yeah, there's, the, they, wa they want this with you. Oh my gosh. And there's the emperor. So like, this is a, this, maybe they're unreliable. Seven of pentacles. They might have not shown, um, they might have, okay, so the Emperor in Reverse is very, un, so sorry, the cards are not on camera. See, look, I'm trying to get better at looking at that. My apologies, Cancer. Um, they're trying to get, like, potentially some obstacles with their children have made them unreliable and they haven't been able to treat you the way you should be treated. Um, so they feel like you've made the choice to move on without them. They think you've left them in the dust. They think you've put them behind you here, Cancer. Um, but that's not what they want. They're upside down and they see you like this. So they see you in a no BS kind of mood. They didn't prioritize you or they used things as an excuse. You know, I have a son. I'm a single mom. But if I want to be with someone, I still give them attention. I still let them know how I feel. I still give them affection, right? Like I interact with them. <laughs> they didn't do that or not on a consistent basis. They were very unreliable with the effort that they put into this with you. Um, and they might have used those as an excuse. And I'm not... I just want to say empathize with parents to understand, but they're, you know, if you're going to date, if you're going to involve somebody, then you have to make sure you can have the time. You can't use it as an excuse. And if you don't have the time, then don't bring somebody in. Right. Um, I'm just saying, just saying cross watcher. <laughs> the, yeah. See what the fuck? Just as I was saying that, if it's not the time, then you don't bring somebody in, <laughs> but they must've had something crazy going on. There must've been a lot going on and it was just really bad timing because they see you as the empress, but they were very unreliable towards you. Um, and they feel like you're not going to put up with their shit. The King of Pentacles in reverse, they could be um, a little bit selfish, but they want to put that behind them. But I feel like your person's confused on how to do that. They're afraid to come and talk to you. They're a little bit timid here. Um, what do you want to say about that Ace of Swords and the Sun in reverse? What else? They're learning a valuable lesson. Maybe they took advantage of you and thought that they could... What's that? There's the Empress again. <laughs> 
<laughs> so they um, want to change things. There's your communication. So you can't expect them to talk to you and tell you how they feel. Maybe step up to the plate a little bit here. Um, no matter. They want to change the. They've learned a very. The page of pentacles for me, Cancer, is um, in reverse. He's my she or she. Like he or she, whatever. The pages can be male or female. But um, this is my lesson card. So they've learned a lesson, but I feel like they might even feel a bit foolish. I feel like part of them took advantage of your kindness. Um, and that's why you might have now be a little bit rigid, like, hey, man, I don't like what I don't like what you did. Um, so they see you as the young person. They're coming to talk to you. They're on fire. Like they got a lot to say. Like, look at how this is like the fire is like trailing off. They have a lot to say. They're not just going to come talk to you and be two seconds. There's going to be a whole a whole fucking story for you, Cancer. So you're about to get, um, yeah, the star in reverse and the high priestess. They're into... They don't know if it's hopeless, though. I, you must have really cut that sword. You must have really cut the leash with them. They don't know if it's hopeless, but they're going to come in and tell you anyway. Um, so let's get a few oracle messages. <laughs> and we'll find out where you are in a month with this person that's on your mind. So talk to us. This person on, what does cancer need to surrender to? Surrender to the idea that you can fix someone. So it's time for a relationship to shift. It doesn't work to try and fix someone. Each person must be accountable for his or her own healing. And the caring connection here between Cancer and this person, what would you like to say, please? Boundaries. Yeah, having sensible boundaries is important. And I believe you've uh, raised the sword. Just make sure you don't go over, over rigid because the Queen of Pe Swords in Reverse can be too rigid, right? But it's our natural reaction when someone's taken advantage of us or has hurt us. It is our natural reaction to do that. Um, and what is this person not saying? That they need to say to cancer. What does cancer need to know? What is the hidden truth? Uh, we both know I am not the one for you. In the bottom, I feel you leaving me behind. So, um, this person, they know they did you wrong, man. <laughs> That's all I can say, cancer. They know. So, let's get your potential outcome. So, let's find out where you and this person are in a month. So, when I say potential, there's always free will. You're going to do what you're going to do. And um, let's see where you guys are in a month. How are you doing? How do you take this conversation? Because they're going to come and talk to you despite this. They want to tell you how they feel. What do you want to say? Where are they in a month from now? So, Ace of Cups. What else we got? So, the Knight of Swords in reverse. The Ace of Cups. The Ten of Pentacles, the Two of Swords in reverse, the Wheel of Fortune in reverse. This is interesting, Cancer. Hold on a second. I got to get into this. What are the other cards? All right. The Ten of Wands. Yeah. The Wheel of Fortune in reverse. And on the bottom, we have Death and Rebirth in reverse. Here's the thing. <laughs> the person that is on your mind at this moment is not in a month from now. So here they are. I feel like it just was a burden for you. Um, whatever they did. That was enough for you. Um, but you're not blocking them. I don't feel like it's like in an ugly place. They're just not the person that you're with. You're in a completely different place doing something completely different. <laughs> you have the Ace of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles. So the person on your mind right now, um, as resistant as you may be, um, I mean, you're still thinking about them, but from what I can see, that's done. If, if, no matter what they say to you, you've made up your mind, Cancer. That's what I see. Um, but I see you in a really good place. Um, let's see if this is someone else or if this is, but you're in the Ace of Cups. So there's another opportunity here. Something is like being given to you that, what is this Ace of Cups? Who is it with? Tell Cancer about this. The Emperor in reverse. Oh, the Two of Pentacles in reverse. And the Seven of Swords in reverse. Okay, so the world in reverse. I was... I, I, for some of you, it is going to be with this person. I was totally reading it differently. So for some of you, it's not. You're going to... But um, if when I said it's not this person, if your heart just like sunk, then you know that you want to be, then this part is for you. Because there are some of you, I was reading that totally different. You have something new coming through. Maybe it's just work um, related that's made you really happy and you're staying solo. But for others of you, no. Nah. This emperor is here. You made the choice. There's unfinished business. Um, they might have... Yeah, they might have been very petty, very immature, but you're giving them another chance. You're not blocking this love with them. Um, you're going to put the burdens behind you. Maybe then wasn't right. Whatever they came and explained to you, with the, um, it just wasn't the right time back then. And you understood and you've moved forward with them. But for others of you, 
There's two different ways that this ended, Cancer. Sorry that it when it happens, but this is how it happens. Um, for others of you, you know, you got something brand new on the horizon. That's going to make you very happy. <laughs> so, Cancer, this is what I have. I hope it helped and resonate. Let's just see if there's anything else that they, there's. Either either way, both of you are moving forward in a very good place. That's, that's what they want to say there. The Ten of Wands in reverse. So, the past baggage is gone. Three of Cups in reverse, Seven of Cups. So, the obstacles being removed, right? The Seven of Cups, you, you see the situation for what it is. The obstacles being removed, you're going to blossom. So, so, for some of you, the obstacles, this person, they're gone. But for others of you, if the obstacle was maybe creating a schedule, maybe, you know, sketching more time in this person's schedule for you to make that time, that kind of thing. Um, for some of you made the choice. Yeah, it goes either way. That's what I got anyway. So, that's the ending. <laughs> I hope you liked your reading. So some of you will be with this person. Some of you won't. Basically, the choice will be yours when they come and talk to you. So let's get your final message here, Cancer. What do you want to say to Cancer to close this out? And Cancer, for those of you that like my style, please like, comment, subscribe. I always appreciate the support. It helps my channel to grow. It helps others get the message. I always appreciate that. What do you want? What else we got here? Oh, oh, we got a lot. Yeah, there's a few different... Um, yeah, okay. So truly sacred rest is soul care. We honor we honor quiet time alone. We intentionally step away from the chaos of life. We unplug from noise and distractions. We relish moments of tranquility. Pause, shed a layer, and recalibrate. Our bodies are our gardens to which we are our gardeners. Hey, this is the first time I've seen this card. Do something to thank your body for its hard work and its miraculous ability to move, feel, and communicate. Our bodies are a beautiful thing. And a man cannot be comfortable without his or her own approval. Take some time before you bed to appreciate yourself for who you are you are on a unique path and you're doing the work cancer that's what i have i hope you enjoyed your reading i wish you the best of luck until next time